What's going on, everybody? It's Super Robot in today. We have in front of you pictures of the Studio Series War for Cybertron Voyager Ironhide. Now, these are official images from In Demand Toys, who always gets these images for their pre orders. Um, notably, he has a new chest, um, he still has the same gun arm. There are some few changes here, but the changes are very welcome over uh, Ratchet. Now, to me personally, when I saw uh, War for Cybertron Ratchet, he didn't really, I, I, I get the vibe of a samurai. This isn't really, makes me think of Drift or something like a white repainted Drift. And I just, you know, from like the movies, it didn't really speak to me, but the Iron High looks a lot better. Can't say I'm going to buy it because like I said, I don't really do the game toys like that. And, you know, there's very few of those I have. But for those I know who want this, we have been saying that this Ironhide is going to look a lot better than Ratchet. And I think he does. And I think he's going to be more sought after than what Ratchet was. So we'll look at the packaging, look at the back, the forward, and then we'll look at the end toy shots. And then we'll just wrap it up. It won't take too much of your time. So basically, it's in the new Studio Series packaging. Um, you know, I believe it has a window. Um, they took off kind of like the sub-series. I guess maybe for 86, they may still leave it there, but they don't have the uh, like War for Cybertron or, you know, like Gamer Edition on anymore. And it's 28 steps to transform. He does come with a nice axe with the red sort of like blades on it. Of course, he has the gun arm. Um, he's gray, primarily red. Yeah, he looks a lot better. Now, I'm just going to say that the robot mode looks a heck of a lot better, in my opinion. Now, other people are going to say different. Um, would I pick this up? maybe if I pick this one up then I got to pick up Ratchet and I don't want Ratchet so I'm probably not going to pick it up however though I will say for a lot of you collectors out there clamoring for studio series figures especially from the games and things like that they did a better job with the Ironhide overall um I think the retooling of the chest is really good um the proportions look better it doesn't look like just Ratchet with just Ironhide's head and painted red this time and I'm glad that he did that um I don't see anything else that's totally different from what I saw at the Ratchet overall, but you know, a color swap, head swap gives you a whole completely different character on the same body it is what it is. We've been doing this for 40 years now. There's no need to cry about it. So what are your thoughts? Leave them down in the comments below. Are you interested in getting this uh, Studio Series War for Cybertron? Where's your Ironhide? For me, no, but for others, I know that's a yes. As always, please like, subscribe, and share. This is Super Robot Air bringing more news and reviews. So then we'll see you soon. Bye-bye.